Howdy, y'all. I'm Mr. Holga. And I'm Todd Puckett. And this is Don's, Don's Used, Used Photo, Photo Equipment. Equipment. Right here in front of, and say it with us, the Great, the Great Wall, Wall of Film. Film. So guys, this is the most special video of the entire year. This is this is our Christmas. This is this is the big New one. New Year's, the, the, the Christmas, big one. the holidays, all wrapped into one. Yeah, this is yeah. this is the official 2023 Holga Week Awards presentation. Ta-da! And as you can see, Todd dressed up. Look at this. Yes. You, you, you're saying, do I look good in this? Oh yeah, you look really awesome. good. Somebody's bring, got to bring a little class. To yeah, I, here I'm just in this just blah old shirt, and you you actually put on the, the jacket. I he, bought the jacket. Just he put for his this. microphone in the little uh, lapel hole there. I mean, you, you look very dapper, very very dapper. <laughs> Chucks, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, caught him uh, listening to jazz earlier today too. Oh uh, yeah, loved swing jazz. Mm -hmm. So guys, this is Holga Week, uh, it, and happy Holga Week. I know it is a long time. It is more than just a week, which I'm going to explain to you guys. So uh, I don't really want to go into detail in the rules. I'm just going to give you the key dates. We got we got better videos for details, yeah. If you want to know all about Holga Week, go check out one of our older videos. I might put the link above Todd's well, head over yeah, there. Yeah, we even have like a ch uh, watch list of everything. In That's Holga. right. There's uh, yeah. a, Well, there's a... Uh, yeah, the U YouTube, not YouTube channel. It's the YouTube. Uh, yeah, it is a list. Mm -hmm. Yeah, much list. Anyway, well, all go, things go Holga. Check those, go check those go, out. Yeah, You'll like that. Yeah. So Holga Week Phase One, and there are four phases, guys. Phase One is the taking of the pictures. So October first through seventh of the current year. So it's not last year's photos or the year before that, or anything like that. Always, always, always have to take new fresh photos now you can take yep. them on expired film but they have to be current photos right they're expired focus too <laughs> there you go it could be old hogos it doesn't really old matter hogos. so phase one is taking photos so if you would taken photos october 1st through 7th then you get to proceed to phase two mm -hmm. phase two is processing scanning editing lightly, lightly. and submitting that mm -hmm. is from October 8th to November 8th. Now, yep. the submitting is the, the most important part because yes. every year... Somebody goes... Everybody waits till the very end to submit. And uh, now for everybody who... And there were, there, there's usually one or two, maybe a couple, who submit photos and then they're like, I can't find my photos on there anywhere. It's because you probably had an issue or an error or something like that. You didn't contact me. I don't know what's going on until yeah. the contest is running. In which yeah. case, I can't help you at that point. So, when so passed, s yeah. the sooner, the better. You yes. know, if you have an Stop issue waiting. and you can't submit your photos, then you can. Then I can help, but I can't help otherwise. Yep. Anyways, um, phase three, judging and voting. So phase three, which is uh, November 10th through 17th this year, that's when we turn it over to our, our category judges. Illustrious category of judges. And we turn it over to our regional uh, sponsors, and we turn it over to you guys who yep. actually submitted photos for Holga Week. So this is the great part. If you didn't submit photos for Holga... Is that a cross between a photo, photo and a Holga? Did I say focus? You said if, focus. If you did not submit <laughs> Holga photos yes. this year, then you can't vote. You can look at all the photos. Okay. Honestly, I like focus better. I, it is nice. It is cool. But maybe that's a t-shirt. Anyways. So... Uh, we had lots and lots of people submit votes, so that tells me that the site must be working. They could actually mm -hmm. vote. We had so many great uh, people voting. Now, we are, of course, here at Phase 4, and Phase 4 is the awards. It's the blazer jacket phase. That's right. And, you know, we have that on his uh, dry cleaning bill as part of the uh, one line <laughs> item in the budget. So. When we get a budget, we'll pay for it. <laughs> so... November, today, right now, it is November 22nd of uh, 2023, or at least that's when this video is going to be coming out. Uh, I am doing an Instagram live from Dealey Plaza, Dallas, Texas at 12.30 p.m. Central Time. Which has already happened. Which has already happened if you're watching this video. But for this, next year. This video comes out at 1 o'clock uh, Central Time, Dallas Central Time. Yep. So that is also happening as well. Um, so that's the premiere. You are watching this right now. And thank you for watching this. Yes, we really do appreciate thank it. Thank you. And we are ready. We're, we're rolling through this. All he right. said, let's make this one a short let's, one. Let's be tight. Well, the Oscars are like, what, three hours long. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we can get it in under three. Yeah, yeah. And be much more entertaining. <laughs> well, there's no singing and dancing numbers. Right that's anywhere. why it's in there more entertaining. It's just us. <laughs> All right. So, oops, see, I, my See? page, my script is flipped. 
Uh, just the facts, my friends. Just the facts. Here are the Hoga facts. Mm -hmm. 24 countries this year. Wow. That That's is up from last year. Plus four from last year. Yes. Okay. Now, I'm not going to give any percentages, and I'm not going to list the countries. Nope. Though we're just doing just the facts. 254 photographers. More than last year. Which is plus 22 photographers. Yeah. You know, next year's goal, would love to see over 300, 300. photographers. That 300. next year is the 10-year anniversary. Ooh, shh, shh, oh, shh, 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 shh. He's jumping ahead. I am, but you know, it's exciting. It is. 100 female photographers. The most, uh, eight plus female photographers. Fantastic. Not mm -hmm. the 50% that I would really like. Mm -hmm. However, but it's more nice. female photographers. Mm -hmm. And uh, ladies, I always appreciate it when you're shooting your holgas. That's right. 715 photographs. Wow. So we crossed the 700 mark. That is 46 more photos than last year. That's awesome. amazing. That's awesome. awesome. Guys, thank you very much. You're doing an awesome job. As a matter of fact, you were talking to one of the regional sponsors. Who? Mm -hmm. What did he, What was the comment he said about all, all the photos? Two things. He said there were a lot more photos than he thought there would be. Yeah? And they were a lot better than he thought they would oh, be. Oh, yeah. They're really good. Really they really good. are. I went through it, and I looked. And it's like I go through. Anyway. I was just off we'll, track we'll wait, here, but we'll but it's it's highly highly important. It is. They're really good. All right, Holga Nature got two hundred and one uh, photos. That's unfortunately minus three. Oh, uh, I know. Holga Pinhole got fifty four photos. That's unfortunately minus fourteen. Oh, you're going to wait. You're going to notice a trend uh, here. Yep, 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 yep. We're going to notice a trend. Holga Portrait got seventy seven photos. That's minus thirty two. Wow. Ugh. Holga Street, the biggest category by far every time. Yep, yep. 289 photos. That's minus six. Oh, my goodness. So I mean, so wait, wait, wait. We down, had, down, down, down. But we, yet, we had more hope. Oh, we had more photos. Yes, more photos. And we had less photos in each category. Uh, yes. So I, I, don't the the I don't know what how that's possible. I don't know how that happened. The, the difference is up? the brand new category of Holga Effect. 88 photos wow. right there. It, it robbed from everybody. It, it did. Just, it did. Across the board. I was hoping that maybe one or two of them would at least match or a little bit. No. Nope. Holga Effect just took over. You guys apparently like Holga Effect, and I, we really appreciate that. Oh, gosh, yes. Yes. So That's, that's great. It's, it's great. But now next year, Holga Effect has got 88 to beat. <laughs> I, I put them down as plus 88. Yeah, plus 88. <laughs> yeah, that's a good. From zero to plus 88. That's, yeah. All right, so uh, I have a Holga confession to make. Can you can you hand me that little thing over there? Okay, okay. Uh, I'm telling you. Uh, all right, so this this my friends is the gold Holga that is going out this year. Mm -hmm. um, somebody, uh, so I actually put out a little reel with the uh, Holga week uh, for me spray painting the Holgas, yep. and one sharp-eyed Yuren Buttleman, <laughs> here I'll let you hold. He said, "Why are there two Holgas there?" I'm like, oh, I, yeah, I was hoping you weren't going to notice that there were two Holgas there. Um, all right, my confession to you guys is that with everything that I've been doing over the last year, uh, moving and uh, moving and moving and contractors, uh, I just recently sent the gold Holga out. Just recently. So I got it done before Holga Week is out, but I just packaged it all up and sent it all out because I just have been too busy. But now, now, so the the gold Holga that went to Alistair Place has, is already sailing across the pond as we speak right now, and uh, unfortunately, you're not going to see it in his video that he has the gold Holga because it hasn't got to him yet. But that's my confession. I feel bad. I feel very bad. But I couldn't possibly do any worse, right? See, I told you I had a confession, and I wanted to apologize to Alistair. I'm sorry that it took so long, but your gold Holga is on the way. I absolve you. <laughs> Because <laughs> you know how busy we've been, right? Yes. I appreciate it. But yes. this gold Holga is ready to go. Is, don't take that knob off because that one's not is not glued on. Um, uh, my brother, who uh, <laughs> who actually did the laser uh, engraving on Alistair's Holga, he's going to do a different kind of laser engraving for this one. And as soon as I have a name, oh wait, I already have the name. Uh, as soon as I can, I'm going to get that little nameplate slapped on here, and I'm going to be shipping this Holga out no matter where it goes. All right. All right. So it's going to be much faster. Very much, good. Much faster. Very good. So wow. once again, I am very sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. The gift they kept on giving. <laughs> 
I'm hoping they'll all understand. I'm trying to be truthful sure, here. Sure, sure. I don't want there to be a scandal. Oh, he didn't no. give the guy his prizes. No, no, I got him his prizes. It just took a while. It took a while. It took a while. I'm sorry. <laughs> all right. All right, so we have the Holga Regional Sponsor Award. So first of all, I want you guys to know why we're calling it Regional Sponsor Award. So in the past, we had tried to get sponsors, a great sponsors, which of course we've gotten Ilford in the past, we had gotten Cinestill, we had gotten Freestyle, and they were phenomenal sponsors. But the issue for us was that we had to, I had to gather up all these prizes and then turn around and send them out. And that's really one of the reasons why oh, yeah. it takes so long to get out the prizes. Because if I couldn't get it done before Christmas, uh, there's always one thing after that. There's a freeze, there's bad weather, there's this, that. It's like, oh. And, and yeah, some of those places didn't send you the things until They didn't send me the things until very uh, late. And, and so that's why we're kind of changing up. So we're going with regional sponsors. Yeah. So uh, when well, we, we announce a winner, quicker. it'll then be between the regional sponsor and the winner to say, hey, uh, I would like to have my prize. And they'll say, here you go. And mind you, they only have to do one thing. And we don't yeah. have to do anything. Right, for that. But the, the whole hope of the regional sponsor, though, mm -hmm. is that they will spread the word that Holga Week is a thing, and it's a great thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so each of the regional sponsors gets the ability to uh, pick a winner. And so each, each winner, they will just deal one-on-one -on -one and get them their prize. And it kind of winds up giving more, more prizes. I, th I think so. And so I was actually uh, late in contacting regional suppliers this year. Huh. Uh, I'm going to start immediately as soon as Wolga Week is, uh, is done here. I'm going to start saying, hey, we'd love to have you as a regional sponsor um, all over the globe. I mean, I want yep. every place that shoots. I mean, every we, continent. 24 countries. I would love to have a regional sponsor in all 24 countries. Oh, more countries. Wouldn't that be That's awesome? Exp like, exp yeah. Absolutely. I mean, because if, if the regional sponsor promotes film photography and photo labs in their region, yes. that should be only good for their business. Yeah, absolutely. And the regional sponsors only pick from their area. So, their for region. example, the first one, Analog Wonderland. Mm -hmm. uh, they selected a winner from, uh, from the UK and the EU, okay? Yep. Because yep. that is their region. Yep. Now, the rest of our sponsors are all in the U.S., and I gave them a list. Of, hey, here's all the U.S. people. So it's unfortunate for the people around the world, but, you know, what? like I said, we would like to have more regional sponsors. Yep, yep, yep. So if and you, you're if, not moving, so next year we should have a little bit more... Uh, we'll, we'll get to that yeah. part, right? So first up, and I'm going to hand Todd this lovely stack of you. This right here is a stack of regional sponsor winners. He give, finally gets give, to do give, something. Give, give me, yeah, this is, this is, uh, uh, yes, baby. Whoa, yeah. All right, so I, I need all these. You can have one. <laughs> Just one. Our did, first regional did, sponsor. Did I already abuse my? <laughs> our first regional sponsor is Analog Wonderland. Uh huh. And they are in Tradeaway Hill, Loudwater, High Wacombe, United K. Uh, now this is the uh, this group. They actually started just uh, a year, a couple of years ago. So it was actually really exciting to actually have a new uh, photo processing lab and all that kind of good stuff. Ooh. Just started out. Oh, you notice it says that yeah, on there? Yeah. Just almost like this. Look at that. Almost. Almost. A little difference. So thank you very much to uh, Analog Wonderland. And their winner is... Carolyn Kinnett, Halston, Cornwall, GB, Nine Maidens of Light, Bellstone, Dartmoor, UK, Hoga, 120, WPC, Fomapan, 100. Analog Wonderland winner. I know. Now, I'm going to put the uh, the thing on the screen for you guys, but I'm going to show Todd what the picture looks like because I did not print out the pictures. Da, 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 da. Hold, please. I like All this. Right. I like this. Which one? Analog Wonderland oh, right there. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know I'm blind now. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I forget you're blind sometimes. That's gorgeous. Yeah, beautiful photo. Fantastic. Beautiful congratulations, photo. Carolyn. Yes, congratulations. Okay. Well, uh, you don't. See. You can just put them up there. You don't have to re. No, no, no. You don't have to re-envelope them. For these me. are precious things. All right. Now this is, believe it or not, the Don's used photo equipment regional winner. Wow. You have actually selected one. I did. You were giving out a prize too. Very good. Now. Yes. Did I just read it off? Well, do we need to? T well, see, the point is we're going to talk about each one of these places. Don's Use Photo Equipment here in Dal in the heart of Dallas, Texas. Mm -hmm. uh, it's been selling thump, thump, film thump, and thump. cameras and studio equipment for 25 plus years. 26 plus. 
Oh, okay. 26 plus years. Don't short me a year. I mean, you know, you are the heart of the analog community yeah. in the in this neighborhood around Texas. We're the Great Wall. We're, and, we're the home of the Great Wall. The of home film. of the Great Wall of Film. Which and, is known worldwide. And I've heard you are a landmark for giving somebody giving directions. Oh, yeah, yeah. we're just right next to Don Chu's photo. Oh, and they yeah. say, oh, I know where that is. <laughs> yeah, I know where that is. I know where that is. <laughs> oh, oh, and the most yeah. important thing. Yes. The Intergalactic. International World, World Headquarters, Headquarters for, for Hogan Week. Week competition. Okay. Um, Who did you actually, he himself, selected a winner? Well, let's see if I can get this right. Habib Sedane, Richardson, Texas, U.S. House of Pumpkin, Dallas Arboretum, Texas. Hoga 120N, Agfa, Afop, Pan 200. Agfa, that's got to be expired. Well, no, no it's A V I P H O T. I hadn't heard of that one. <laughs> Don's used photo equipment winner. Congratulations. Yeah, Habib. so this is really fun. And you've seen and the I photo. Said, I love the photo. There, there, there were, you know, like, like, the, like another person said, there were a lot of really good photos. And out of the lot of really good photos, there were a, I, I had like, Started off with two, then it, then I went through it again, started off with three, and then just kind of got up to four. And I'm sitting there going, each time I look, there's more and more I want to put into the <laughs> final group. And I got it down to three, and I love all three of them, but that's the one that got picked. All right. All right, so this is a uh, sponsor, Photo Deox Pro. Uh, they uh, are a, manuf a manufacturer or reseller for yeah. various uh, camera parts. They love Hoga Week. So, for example, I was watching some of their videos. So, Sean... Uh, Anderson, uh, he's I kind of follow him on uh, Instagram, different places like that. They themselves do some videos, so you probably should go check out their YouTube uh -huh. because they're sh showing how to use studio lighting. I think they I think they make studio lightings, and they definitely sell yeah. uh, like uh, adapters, adapters, and things like that. So the, one of the adapters I saw them showing, which would look pretty cool, was a, a Nikon tilt shift adapter for Z mount lenses. It's like mm. oh. I said, well, I need one of those for the regular, <laughs> the regular DSLRs. That yeah. would look that would look so yeah. cool. Oh yeah. But they've got lots of cool stuff like that. So please do go check them out. Photo Deox Pro. Mm -hmm. uh, they are in Gurney, Illinois. Mm -hmm. I like saying Illinois. I think I was the first store in De in Texas to to have Photo Deox. Really? At one point. Yeah. Excellent. Yep. So you know, thank you very much, Photo Deox. And the winner is? The winner is Anna Star, Seattle, Washington, U.S., Forest on Ferries on Film, Washington State Ferries, Hoga 120N, Portra 400, Photo Deox, Photo Deox Pro winner. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember seeing that. that is, very nice, yeah, very yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. This is fun. I, it, it's fun every year that we, I still I know, can't believe I they know. let us do this. Who's going to stop us? <laughs> so uh, Legacy Photo Lab is our next regional sponsor. Uh, Legacy Photo Lab is both in Dallas and Fort Worth. They uh, do film processing. They do scanning. I think they do restorations. They do printing. I know they do. Uh, do they not do uh, scanning movies? No. I, I thought, no. I thought they did scanning like eight millimeters. Oh, and Legacy like that. do. Yeah, yeah do. Legacy do. do. Sorry, that. sorry. So I don't think they develop it, but I think the, they the, scan uh, they, them. They scan uh, movies onto digital. They scan uh I think photos, if you convert, uh, I think they do conversion of uh, conversion, VHS yeah. and all yeah. things like that. So, a lot of things. So, uh, as a matter of fact, I recommended it to one person who needed a, a photo restoration. She absolutely loved what they did. So, mm -hmm. guys, mm -hmm. so they do, do a lot. Our friends at Legacy Photo Lab, uh, they were one of the three locations that got my Holga Week film, did a phenomenal job on it. And a quick turnaround. And a quick turnaround, yes, very yeah. very well. So, yeah. And their winner is Cesar Gonzalez, Bakersfield, California, U.S. Bixby Creek Bridge, Big Sur, California, Ahoga 120N, Kodak Tri-X, yep. Legacy Photo Lab winner. Oh, yeah, I didn't see that one, I guess, and things. That is, that is really That's very good. nice, yeah. very nice. I mean, you know, some of these photos sometimes get really, it's like, you know, unless you're a, a, a Hoga aficionado, is some of some of them look just too good to be it's like they came from a cheap plastic camera. Exactly. But yes. you know, you'll notice the beautiful vignetting. There's the yeah. sharp spot focus. It, the corners. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. It, it, it is it, those telltale signs that says I'm a Holga I'm and this is a great shot. See my perfect imperfection. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> next up the bat is Lone Star Darkroom. Now, if I'm not mistaken, 
Todd. Yes. Don's used photo and you equipment. Sell them more, sir. Is currently the uh, pickup and drop off location for uh, right. leg, uh, for, Lone for Lone Star, Star Darkroom, Darkroom, right? Until they get their new location next Which week. Which they're working on it Couple right of now. Weeks, yeah. Oh, uh, maybe by the time feverishly. this thing comes out. It could knows? it could be. Uh, as a matter of fact, there's we're I'm trying to hook up with Chris to so we can do a live. So mm -hmm. guys, do stay tuned for that live on Instagram. So we'll be talking to them. Mm -hmm. But uh, so they've been, you know, we, I, I hang around here on a Saturday. People are just dropping off and picking up film. Drop, and uh, as a matter of fact, it's because of them we said what a trifecta was. What, what's a trifecta, Todd? A trifecta. Someone comes in to drop film off to get processed. Uno. Uno. Someone then picks up negatives that have already been processed. Dos. Dos. Then they say, while I am here, why don't I buy some film? Trace. The the film trifecta. The film trifecta, yes. yes. And he loves it when that happens, especially oh, the do, last one. They are, yes, yes. I don't, <laughs> yes, I, I, I don't mind the other, but I, I am particularly fond of the latter. He's been the pretty face of Lone Star Darkroom for quite some time. Yes, yes. Maybe that's why Which the is business that, is doing so well. They, they, they could use better business if you had a hot assistant up here. <laughs> true, true, that's true. <laughs> but. And the winner this. is. Go ahead, butcher Flavia this name. Flavia Fontana Gustist. Gusti. Flavia Fontana Gusti. Gusti. It's G-I-U-S-T-I. Madison, Wisconsin, U.S. <laughs> Trichrome at Tinney Beach, Madison, Wisconsin, USA. Shot with a Holga 120 GFN on Ilford HP 5 Plus, Long Star Darkroom winner. And says, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, yeah, that's fun. That is so fun. Very nice, very nice. Yeah. And our last and oldest uh, regional sponsor oh, my, is Old oldest. School Photo Lab. Oh, uh, our friends yeah. Popper up in uh, New Hampshire. New, New Hampshire. New Hampshire. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I send my film there as well. As a matter of fact, Old School got my film. Uh, Lone, uh, old School and Lone Star and Legacy, they all got my film this year. Mm -hmm. um, old School has been doing uh, the Hoga Week since, as a matter of fact, 2019 when Todd and I took over. So that's five years we've been five doing this. Five years. Um, I'm not, I'm not going to say that it's going to be 10 next year, but still, anyways, five, no, we've been doing no, it for five years. And old school has been a part of this. We can't uh, appreciate them enough for what they have done for us. And they've been us. involved in everyone. They have. Oh, and oh, I have a feeling they're probably going to be involved in, in a couple more to go. So there yeah. is a great film location up there in the Northeast. But, you know, they take film all over the United States. Uh, I always send my film. If I have to send it anywhere, it goes to the East Coast. It, it doesn't go to the West Coast. So I, I'm, not, I'm not, say, not saying any names. No, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> and the old school photo win lab winner is wow okay <laughs> natalia uh -huh. radsky juice <laughs> i've been waiting for you to have to say that name <laughs> r-a-d-z-i-e-j-e-u no it's j-e-w-s-k-a ske yeah juice <laughs> radzi juice mm -hmm. boston massachusetts is that it? Boston, Massachusetts, Boston. U.S., Untitled, uh -huh. Massachusetts, Hoga 120, Portra, doesn't say which one, Old School Photo Lab winner. <laughs> I've been waiting for you to have to say that Man, name for alive. quite some time. Woo! That is <laughs> I'm thinking, ooh, mouthful. Todd's going to trip on this one. Well, uh, yeah, I, I'm sure I got... I do not give him pronunciation guides at all. No, no, you no. You are just out of luck. That's why he called me Ron Burgundy earlier. <laughs> he just reads. I didn't read what's him. in front of me. However, I think it sounds. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And what was that one? Which oh, I'm sorry. There you go. Yeah. Oh, that is gorgeous. I know. Yeah. It's it's a, obviously yeah. a double exposure. It could have been. It could have been. Actually, it was originally in Holga effect, but yeah. this became their uh, their the old school photo lab winner. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Thank you very much, guys. That was awesome, and we certainly do look forward to having some more regional sponsors next year. If by chance you know of a photo lab or a camera store that is not currently participating, why don't you say, hey, send, uh, send Holga Week a DM and say you would like to be involved because we would love to have you. Uh, like I said, uh, 24 countries would love to have one in each country. Absolutely. Yeah. And I don't think it's going to happen, but I would certainly like to have it. Well, it won't happen if we don't try. That is true, too. Yeah. I, I like his spirit. Yeah. And yeah, I think we could. Uh, pro I know somebody in France we may talk to and see if they don't know any photos oh. in France. Yeah. All right, so Holga Week, 
category prizes. So uh, unfortunately, the regional winners are not uh, getting ca uh, category prizes. Now, um, mm -mm. the category prizes we're going to try and- they are getting some prizes. They're getting prizes from the regional sponsors themselves. The regional yeah. sponsors are going to take care of them. As far as the category prizes, that is being taken care of by Holga Week, our, our bank account. So we are going to uh, put together a cash prize for each one of them. Um, I was thinking it was going to be about $100. Cash goes through the mail easier than anything else. That's well, it's not like cash cash. It's a <laughs> yeah, we're not sending dollar bills or coins no, or no. anything like yeah, that. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, the, but the true prize, yeah. the true prize is we are going to print Holga Week winner, custom, custom Holga print. Week champion winner t-shirts. Okay, so mm -hmm. it's going to have 2023 Holga Week of some sort on the front. And it's going to have the winners listed on the back for just the category. So unfortunately, regional uh, winners not going to be listed. However, the, the champion plus the other category winners on the back and mm -hmm. guys uh hopefully if we do it just right we're gonna have some for sale so you guys can buy one of these shirts um Fingers being as how crossed. it's winter i yeah. was thinking long sleeves well i'll take it I'll long take sleeves it. yeah long sleeves all right see yeah. he likes it mikey likes it meeting adjourned <laughs> <laughs> absolutely all right so i hold in my hand Yes. All the Holga Week category winners, guys. Right mm -hmm, here. Mm -hmm. I hold the future of everybody in my hot this little hand This is what we've all been waiting for. All right. So first up to bat is, I'm going in alphabetical hurry here, guys. Holga Effect. Holga, th this is the newest category. The newest category. So Holga Effect, a yes. as a little reminder. Hey, stop that. <laughs> that Holga Effect is anything that you can do effect-wise with a Holga, whether it's a double exposure or it's you're just kind of clicking it and making it a really long uh, picture or something like that. Alistair placed, he essentially made one really long picture of him changing clothes through the entire thing, which was absolutely spectacular, but oh, it was all well, yeah, one yeah, shot. Yeah, yeah. No, so uh, whether yeah. you turn the camera upside down or round, double clicking, uh, anything you do to make a Holga effect, light leaks are a Holga effect. I don't know, maybe you smeared a little Vaseline on to get even more blur on your lens. Who knows? It's a Holga mm. effect and you could do it with your camera and that's, that's what right. this category is all about. All right. Uh, this, this category is uh, being jured by Tales from the Magic Box. Okay. And this is Henry yeah. who's in the UK. He has a podcast. Uh, I, I haven't heard it in a while. Unfortunately, I've been busy, but I think him and his dog Dante, they he makes Frankenstein cameras. He goes out and shoots them. He talks about them. Uh, and, and Henry is very excited the fact that he still keeps getting to do this. He's like, I, he's like, I don't know why they keep letting me be a judge. This is awesome. He loves it. So, very so cool. all right. So Tales from the Magic Box, that is the podcast. Guys, go check it out. And the mm -hmm. Holgi Effect winner is... Oh, now? Oh, yeah. Oh. Well, first of all, excuse me. He's going to start out with the honorable mention first, always. All right. And then he's going to give the winner. All right. Now... Andres Garcia Rodriguez, Mexico City, CDMX, MX, Time Perception, Estado de Mexico, <laughs> Hoga 120, GCFN, Kodak, T-Max 100, right, right. Hoga Effect, Honorable Mention. Honorable Mention. Fantastic. Honorable yes. mention. I'm going to show Todd the photo, but I'm going to show you guys on the screen. So, uh, da, 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 da. hold please. All right, so there we go. Oh, yeah. yeah the definitely yeah. a Holga effect. Yes, definitely. Okay. Definitely. All right, that was. All right, and the Holga effect winner is Angela Marloud, Oakland, California, U.S., like a bird, Oakland, California, shot on a Holga CFN, Portra 400 film, Holga effect winner. Congratulations, both of you. The Holga Effect winner is Angela Marlaud, M-A-R-L-A-U-D. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't know if spelling it makes my pronunciation any better, but uh, it helps people understand what we're trying to accomplish. <laughs> it helps, it helps so much. Yes, and what's that photo then? That's, I mean, oh, I'm so sorry that I yeah, skipped yeah, you there. Yes, there you yes. go. Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. You can definitely see the Holga Effect on that one. Yeah, it looks like a, a double exposure, a light leak. It's got everything. It's got it all. Mm -hmm. All right, hold please. All right, so this is the next one is the Holga Nature category, and and as we say, uh, if you're if uh, if you're outside of cell phone reach, you are in Holga Nature. 
whole good nature can be anything. Uh, trees, it could be landscapes, it could be animals. It doesn't matter if it's an animal in your house or at the farm or on a trail somewhere. Uh, if it's plants or whatnot, it's, it could be whole good nature. It's up to you to make these decisions. Holga Nature was jurored by the old camera guy, David uh, uh, Mihe, Mihaly, excuse me, David Mihaly. I had to put my glasses on for something. Uh, David's got a great YouTube channel, and he's constantly going around shooting old cameras. That's why he is the old camera guy. Mm -hmm. He has a great time shooting uh, anything, brownies, Holgas. It doesn't really matter. He he, uh, sh he shoots new films, the turquoise, all that kind of good stuff. He, sh he shoots everything. Yeah. I, I love watching his videos. They're short and sweet, unlike ours, which are really long. And, and really <laughs> sweet. His videos are great. You should go check him out, the old camera guy on yeah, YouTube. Yeah. And, ours. and the Holga Nature honorable mention goes to, honorable mention always first. Wow, here we go. Andre Kuzminski. Uh, it's A N D R I I K U Z M I N S K Y I. Yeah, that doesn't and make Liv it any better. Levitsky, U A. Time UA gone. UA is by. in Ukraine. Oh. Really? Yes, sir. Uh, see, I did not know that. Uh, the the um, the thing the photo is called "Time Gone By." Mm -hmm. It's in Bruhovci, Ukraine. Shot on a Hoga 120N, Foma Pen 400, Hoga Nature Honorable Mention. Oh, I love that. That's hilarious. Great shot. Great. I mean, that that poor car is being eaten alive. Oh, absolutely. It is just being eaten alive. Absolutely. Line. That is definitely out in nature. <laughs> I mean, although it's a car, it's, it's a car. clearly nature. It's out in nature. Nature's clawing it its is. way back. It is. And the Holga Nature winner is? Yes, Marine Bond, Los Angeles, California, U.S., Road Less Travel, located in Mojave Desert, shot on a Holga 120 pan, Lomo Chrome Turquoise. Uh, I wish Tur we could turquoise. Turquoise. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Jess. Sorry, Jess. Lo love you, Jess. Yeah, yep. Hoga <laughs> Nature winner. Oh, wow. Love the colors. Those yeah. are phenomenal colors. This is, yeah. I mean, you know, they if are. she's they not blowing nice. this up and selling this, I, uh, you know. Yeah. So I'm going to dote on Maureen just for a moment. Now, I have nothing, absolutely zero to do with any of the selections here. Yeah. However, yeah. Uh, as some of you guys know, I'm a little bit of a snob on Twitter, and I only follow up to 100 people. Maureen is actually in that 100 piece. So I, I almost feel like I know her a little bit because I, I see her tweets all the time. I'm yeah, constantly yeah, yeah. stuff back to her. So congratulations, Maureen. I really, you're fantastic. Yeah. Fantastic. And, yeah. And it was the, who, who was the one who picked that winner then? I'm sorry. Once oh. again, that was the old camera guy. The old camera guy. Yeah. yeah that's so David had... uh, Mahaley. Yep. Yep. So, see, so. I said it better this time. Well, yeah, yep. All right. And now we are to one of my favorite categories is Holga Pinhole. Yes, that is. Yeah, I I, I love me some good pinholes. Matter of fact, when I travel biased. for business, yeah. I take a pinhole camera with me. Mm -hmm. It's like why not? Uh, as a matter of fact, my poor little pinhole camera's probably been through TSA more than any of my other cameras combined. So, <laughs> Holga pinhole category is jurored by the Lensless Podcast, mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. is, which is primarily uh, done by Andrew Bartram, but also sometimes by Corey Cannon. Uh, I'm not quite sure if Corey is still a part of it or not anymore, but. Uh, I'm probably actually going to uh, go on an episode uh, here in the future with Andrew, and we're going to talk Holga Week, I hope, and have a good time and discuss these things. things. Uh, I mean, Andrew is a great photographer himself. He take, Obviously, he's very passionate about pinhole photography. He's also passionate about large format photography. Mm -hmm. I think he puts together um, some large format classes in his own darkroom at his own place, which, wow. which, you know, if I ever get my shop together, I could do that too. Mm -hmm. So, you know, guys, go check out either follow... Uh, Andrew, go figure. He's Warboy Snapper. Go, go follow him. Find his two podcasts. I'm sure you're going to enjoy because he's very, very knowledgeable. Mm -hmm. All right, and I'm sorry. Here's the card for you to hold now. All right, and the pinhole, <laughs> the Holga pinhole. Yeah. Honorable mention is. All right, here we go. Andres Garcia Rodriguez, Mexico City CDM MX MX. Celestial Mass, Ace Capatazico, Hoga 120 WPC, Kodak T Max 100, Hoga Pinhole Honorable Mention. 
Now, just in case oh. you think we have mentioned the same name twice, yes, um, Andres has won uh, the uh, honorable mention in two different categories. Wow. Yeah, that's I'm sitting there reading this going yes. deja so, vu. Have I read this once before? Yes, deja you have. Vu. So, Andres, congratulations for two yeah. honorable mentions. Sorry, Unfortunately, you didn't yeah. win, but hey, but, hey, you got your name you got, mentioned twice. Is that two t-shirts then? No, no, no. Oh, okay. no well, the t-shirts the are only going to the winners. The winners. Oh, so sorry, so, Andres. Sorry, sorry. Wow, but we, well, I don't know. We might have to do something if you get two yeah, honorable yeah, mentions. That, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, and the winner, and the winner of the pin, uh, Holga Pinhole, Andy Go, London, Great Britain. The item is called Creation of Eve Dash High, London, UK. Holga, one twenty PC, on film Ilford HP five. Holga Pinhole winner. Oh, Celestial yeah. mass. It's a baby. <laughs> it's a and it's baby. high because the baby's got a hand up. Hi. Hi, and it's wiggling. Hi. So it's a long term <laughs> exposure. Celestial mass. Uh, I love a good sense of humor. Yes, absolutely. Good sense of humor. Fantastic. All right, so we're now to the Hogo portrait category, which is uh, jurored by the Sunny 16. So, uh, first of all, portraits, obviously anything you can do is for a portrait, whether it's a person, whether it is a, uh, a like a yeah. dog or a cat or anything like that. If you consider it a portrait, it's a portrait. We're not judging. However, faces are, <laughs> faces are probably better. No, we're not judging we're, someone else's. Somebody else is judging. <laughs> Uh, this one is being juried by the Sunny 16 podcast, which uh, last time I checked was still Aid, uh, Graham, and Rachel. Is what did he say? I'd love to have a uh, Instagram live with Rachel because I know she did those uh, Ilford uh, videos for a while. Oh yes, yeah, yes, yeah. So, Rachel. Uh, who she we, has her own little thing, uh, the uh, little sh village shop or little shop village. So that's, you know, yeah, I don't it, know that she's one. got a dark room book out there. I think I'd oh, actually love to get man. a hold of that myself. So wow. As I'm stumping for all these people, uh, let me turn over the all important card to Todd here. Yeah, so, because some of these people have books out. I didn't see. That's important. That know. is important information. So once yeah. again, the Sunny Sixteen podcast, and this is the Holga Portrait honorable mention. Ah, we are ready. Timothy Hathaway. Pace, Florida, U.S. Fuck cancer and fuck your pink ribbons. Kate, the subject. Pace, yep. Florida. Holga, 120 CFN. Shot with Kodak Portra 160. Hoga, Hoga Portrait Honorable Mention. Yeah, yeah. I remember this seeing this one. That's it. That how could you mission. how could you not remember seeing oh, this picture? It's a very strong, powerful picture, and that's what whole portraits are supposed to be. Exactly. I mean, you know, that's one of the, the things that I like about this con this entire contest. We're all using the same camera, but we're all using it in very, very powerful very ways. Very different ways. Very different ways. Yeah. I mean, it could be comical. It could be serious. It could be everything. And yeah. you guys are doing a phenomenal job. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Congratulations to yeah. our winner, Timothy. And uh, now no. for the Holga Portrait nope, nope, winner. No, 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 no. Holga Portrait winner. I didn't read this one. I know. That's what I'm saying. And now for the Holga Portrait winner. Richard Munro. Sangre Grande TT. Where is that? Ah, Jerry is the name of the portrait. Sangre Grande in Trinidad and Tobago. You think that's the TT? That's the TT. <laughs> Trinidad and Tobago. Shot on a Hoga 120N. Foma Pen 400. Hoga portrait winner. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love the background, too. The entire thing is this phenomenal yeah, shot. Yeah. There you go. But you know, had this shot been in color, it might not have been as powerful. I love the fact that it is in black and white, oh, yeah, and the yeah. contrast here is yeah, absolutely beautiful. Yeah, foam pen four hundred, black and white. It's absolutely beautiful as far as that. Let's see, and I will trust you with this pre because I know you, you'll behave. I'm just sitting. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> okay, guys, we are now to the Holga Street category. The Holga Street category is normally the biggest category, and because everybody loves street photography, it doesn't really matter. Outside of your house, down the street, around the corner, uh, it's just anything that is street. It, Boy, graffiti, that's like it's a buildings. It's 7 Eleven commercial. I know, it's all over the place. Well, we, <laughs> we down the street, just around the corner. We are the home of 7 Eleven here today as well in Dallas. <laughs> True. So um, the Holga Street category, which, you know, I always kind of warn the judges, like, realize that this is the biggest category. Yeah. And it, we kind of switch it up. It's kind of like being the. Uh, uh, it's kind of be like, like it, Harry Potter being the dark arts teacher. You know, it always seems like we need to get a new one every year because it's a really rough one. It's so many, so many great shots. 
Yes. Yeah. So this year's uh, this year it went to Studio C41. They are the judges. Studio C41, which of course is run by Bill Manning, Manning yep. who was actually in here. Yes. Said, and I yes. missed him. Yes. You Bill, did. I can't believe I missed you. Uh, Bill Manning, he also runs Atlanta Film Company, mm -hmm. which is a movie film put on 35 uh, spools, and they do, uh, is it ECN2? Yes. ECN2, ECN2 processing. Yeah, it's, yep, because it still has a rimjet on it. Right, still has a rimjet yep. on it. So, guys, uh, go check out Studio C41. Oh, yeah. And, and at least go check were, out Atlanta well Film Company. Very well priced, Com and um, also he processes it. Right. And he does a quick turnaround on the process. Uh, and right. Instagram Live. Had a lovely Instagram chit chat with yep. him, too. Go check yep. that out as well. They got a lot of stuff going on. They do. He, he told me they just had a, um, a photo walk and had over 100 people show up. Wow. Yes. I'm jealous. And all we can get is five. <laughs> No, we had over we had thirty some odd at the nature, at the, at the nature walk. Yeah. Okay. That was a good time. So anyway, I'm jealous. Jealous, and the Holga Street honorable mention is Megan Green, Astoria, New York, U.S. From Ellis Allen is the title of the of the picture, Ellis Allen, New Jersey. Holga 120s, and it was shot with Kodak Triax. Holga Street honorable mention. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's gorgeous. nice. Through a window yes. shot, a uh, Statue, Statue of Liberty, Liberty in the background. Yes. Very, very nice. Yes, that is neat. That is neat. Okay. And congratulations. And the Holga Street winner is Ed Z, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, U.S. on the Delaware, Philadelphia, PA. Shot on a Holga 120N, Kent Mirror 400, a Holga Street winner. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, see, I, I don't remember seeing that photo. That is neat. All right, <laughs> that is a cool photo. I like it. Uh, yeah. Well, I, it's well, it was there. Clearly, uh, some, uh, somebody uh, found it. Somebody well, no, found no, it, no. Right? I'm just, you know, I was trying to go. I went through all my stuff, and it was there was a lot of photos to look through, and I did just sitting there going. Shh, shh, shh. It, I know 715 photos, yeah. guys. That's phenomenal. Yeah. All right, so. This is one of my favorite categories, and it's because you can't enter for this category. You have to be selected for this category. Yeah, every year somebody goes, how do I get my pictures in that? How, 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 do, how do I submit for the Holga Select category? Well, just, just submitting your photos, you are automatically in the Holga Select category. Mm -hmm. um, so the Holga Select category is voted on by all of the submitted Holga uh, photographers. So if you did not submit photos, you didn't get to vote. So there's no ballot box stuffing here or anything like that. Yep. You actually have to submit. Now, uh, there is more than one honorable mention. As a matter of fact, there are two honorable mentions here. Wow. And the reason is, too, because, you know, when I have photos that are so close or when I have photos that led the, almost the entire week, I mean, because I watched them as they kind of, they're jockeying for position. And, uh, you know, sometimes you, you have to get that, that extra honorable mention in there because yeah. their photo was really loved by a lot of people. All right. So the first... Holga Select Honorable Mention winner. Scott Payne, Cincinnati, Ohio, U.S. Foggy morning on the Great Miami River. Cincinnati, Ohio, shot on a Holga 120N. Ilford HP5, a lot of Ilford HP5 being shot. Holga Street, uh, Select Honorable Mention. Oh, that is a beautiful shot, yes. Very good, that, this, yes, this shot yes. was, had the lead for the longest time. Oh my gosh! I know, and you know, and this one was act, this next one honorable mention. Good, good favorite of my own. I I, I did not, and I don't vote, but I, I really liked this one. All right, we have Jonathan Borini, Las Vegas, Nevada, U.S. Ship Rock, Ship Rock, New Mexico, U.S. Shot on a Hoga 120, Ilford HP 5 Plus, Hoga Select honorable mention. It, I mean, the shot is once again. It's framed through the. Oh, the it's framed the through door. the car window. Yeah. But and and Mind of course it, the oh. window almost looks like it's a like a beetle window. I know it's probably not, but it, it, it's like oh, that looks very nice. That's a fantastic shot. <laughs> and those are the two honorable mentions. And the now two honorable mentions. Now for the Holga Select winner. And that goes to Ed Chin, Hillsboro, Oregon, U.S. Eric Chin. Eric Chin. What did I say? Eric oh, uh, Chin, actually. Hoga Preception, Portland, Oregon. Hoga 120N, Kodak Gold 200. Okay. Hoga Select Winner. Hoga Select Winner. 
Whoa. You know, obviously a double exposure turned it yeah. upside down. Yeah, yeah, I love yeah. the, the picture of the clouds, color of the clouds. Oh, I like yeah, it's yeah, a phenomenal yeah. job. It is. A lot I, of I can clearly that, see why this one. Now, this one did start take, uh, taking away, like almost like Secretariat, started putting a lot of votes between it and the next one. So <laughs> you guys clearly like this one, and that's what matters. There we go. All right, guys, uh, this is the moment we had all, we're all all waiting for. Uh, th this is the most important oh. award in the entire thing. And mm -hmm. I'm actually entrusting the envelope to Todd. So before today, Alistair knew who it was. Uh, I knew who it was. Now you're going to be the third person to, besides my printer, the third person to actually know the 2023 Hoga Week champion. Uh, now, uh, Alistair, I think, also had issues trying to find uh, the right one as well because he was like i think he was waffling back and forth between a few of them they're, they're, it's people don't understand it's tough it's a daunting job it is tough and the number is going up every year yes more to select from yeah i mean the, the first year that i did it way less number of, oh very easy for me yeah. to do. Uh, but but now 715 yeah so the uh, uh this is going to be selected by the 2022 hoga week champion alistair place of a uh, uh, Charlbury, Oxfordshire, UK. We he we present to you the 2023 Holger Week champion. Now so we have a... 53 entrants. I'd like to thank you, Mr. Holger, for organising such an incredible competition every October. I'd also like to thank Johnson for picking my image last year. My choice of Holger Week champion this year is this image called Cold by uh, Damon Campbell in Calgary, Canada. I love the title, the image, the portrait, the golden leaves and the blue but cloudy sky. Congratulations, Damon, and enjoy your time as Holger Week champion 2023. Back mm -hmm. and, and Todd, just to make sure we heard that correctly, the winner, the 2023 Holger Week champion is... Damon Campbell, Calgary, Alberta, Cal Canada? Oh, is this is EA? Canada. Canada, yeah. It's cold is the name of the, of the photo. Yep. Calgary, Canada, shot on a Holga 120N. Kodak Gold 200. Congratulations, Damon, for being the 2023 Holga Week champion. There can be only one. There can be only one. And, uh, ah, you love and, it. Uh, I'm sorry, it was Damon? D A M O N. Damon, Damon. you have the uh, daunting task of selecting the 2024 Holga Week champion. Yes. This is a phenomenal shot. L absolutely love those colors. <laughs> those are phenomenal oh, yeah. colors. Yes. Blue, white, just the the gold the, of the leaves, the, leaves, the, 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 the pose of the the model there. Yep, yep. yep it's yep, a yep. it's a phenomenal shot. Is, Fantastic! Congratulations, Damon. Congratulations! You are the 2024 Hoga Week champion. Thank you very much to uh, Alistair for selecting this champion. Mm -hmm. You've done a really great job. Mm -hmm. Fantastic, everybody. Oh man, I tell you, I'm exhausted. Right. That Ooh. almost brought real tears, man. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's fun and exciting. Um, I think it's better than the Oscars. Uh, you know, it's so, so much better. So much better. So much better. Yeah. All right, guys. So let's finish up here. The, the big question I know I'm going to be asked as soon as this is all over is, will mm. there be a Hoga Week 2024? And the answer is, of course, yes, because uh, we are addicted to this. We love it very much. We just have got to do it. So one shape, form, or another, there will be a Holga Week 2024. We, we have just got to make it happen because it's the 10-year anniversary for, uh, for Holga Week. And now people will sit there and go, well, wait, you've only been doing it. We've only been doing it for five years. So how can that be the 10th? Right. Well, I, I was actually the first Holga Week winner in 2015. Mm -hmm. So 15, 16, 15, 15, 15, 15, 2024 is the 10th year. Um, so Holga Jen actually gave Holga Week to us in 2019, in which mm -hmm. case we've had it for the last five years. Yeah. So four years prior to that, these five years, that means next year's the 10th. That's just that's just math. That is. That is. It, and I, and I, I didn't run out of fingers to do he that. He did too. not. So we're yeah. going to have a phenomenal time. Yes. Uh, when is Holga Week 2024, Todd? Mm, uh, I didn't even cue him on this one. I know, I know. I didn't have any time to prep. So I'm going to go with October 1st through the 7th. Right. 2024. So that, that's when we will be taking photos taking again photos. and starting the, and cranking up this entire process. And then there will be the editing, processing, then the judging, and then the November 22nd. It's, you know, before you know it, it'll be here again. Uh, 
Tell me about We'll it. be giving out these awards one I more mean, time. Do you, you, you don't, whenever you hear this right now, it's only 10 months away to the start. Oh, yeah. That's pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Well, well so, 10 months and maybe a week, but still, yeah, it's ten, pretty close. 10 in a week, 10 months in a week. It's not a full 12 months. I mean, it's just like we're starting into it no. in a short form. And that's why I'm asking you guys uh, for help with regional sponsors yes. right now, because yes. uh, as soon as this thing closes, I'm immediately starting, and I'm going to be hounding regional sponsors like, hey, would love to have you, would love to have yes, you. Yes, yes, All yes. over the globe. Like I said, 24 countries, I would love 24 regional sponsors. 24, oh, well, I'd love more and then get over 1,000 photos. Oh, I'm telling you, man, whoever picks next year's, right. that would be insane. Well, so That's if you a are a camera on. store. There are a lot of great photos in this to pick from. So, oh, I mean, wait, it's, wait it's a, a lot. Yeah. So if you're a camera store or you're a film processing lab, please, please send me a DM and say, hey, we would lo I would love to have. Somewhere in the this. world. Right. Somewhere in the world. Well, I'm going to wrap this up with yes. the Holga Week thanks. And my first and foremost, I'm going to thank my partner in crime here, Todd Puckett, for putting up with uh, me all this time and uh, for encouraging me to get this thing better. Uh, mm -hmm. Every year we try to make it a little bit better. I'm not quite sure we accomplished that goal this year, but we, oh, you know. Wait, the Holga effect was a smashing hit. The Holga effect was good, but, you know, we still need to do other things. I need to get I know, yeah. the, the moves and different things like that way too distracting. They're all settled now, so there will be no excuses next year for the 10. That's right. The big one zero. The big one zero. And uh, listen, uh, all the great comments is one of the things I really, really love for you guys. Everybody, every time I hear somebody uh, DM me on Instagram, they, they thank us for what we're doing. They appreciate it very much. Yeah, and, it's a lot to it. And it is a lot to it, And but I really appreciate everybody's appreciation for this. So thank you very much, guys. Mm -hmm. Thank you, yes. Um, with that, I think we're going to wrap this up. We are indeed. So guys, thank this you. is still we a regular video. It. Please do share, like, subscribe, tell oh, two friends, yes, tell yes. a couple of friends. Next year, I'd like to have over 2,000 followers on the YouTube, and we're going to tell more people about this, and we're going to bring more Maybe people in. Maybe that's what Santa will bring you for Christmas. <laughs> Guys, that's it for us. We'll I see you later. So. See you bye next bye. year. Take care. Later. Oh, 2,000 followers. You're awfully greedy. Uh, that is Gotta get one gold right there. Keep those for posterity's sake. Absolutely.